You'll never guess who's an abortion supporter. Hi, I'm Missy Stone with Students for Life, and this is your Pro-Life Gen News for August 30th. Let's get started. Texas Christian University is allowing students to intern at Planned Parenthood for school credit. An email from the History Department at TCU said, Planned Parenthood of Greater Texas is seeking an intern to work on a project highlighting its history in Fort Worth since it was established here in 1935. Seeing as Planned Parenthood's founder is a eugenicist that hung out with the Ku Klux Klan, I'm not really sure they want to be highlighting their history. But more importantly, as a so-called Christian university, religious pro-lifers are calling this partnership a disgrace to their faith. A coalition of 430 groups, including Planned Parenthood and NARAL, recently sent a letter to the United Nations asking September 28th to be Safe Abortion Day. This is part of a larger campaign to stop the prosecution of those participating in illegal abortion around the world. But what's really interesting about this letter is that the U.S. is listed as one of the countries that prosecutes abortion, even though we have some of the most liberal abortion laws in the world. So who exactly is the U.S. prosecuting? Let's see. There's Gosnell, who was killing women, and his facility was described as a house of horror. And then there was the guy who learned to do abortion from YouTube and was doing them out of the back of his car. How is not prosecuting these kinds of people helping with safe abortion day? I don't get it. I don't, I can't, hashtag I can't. <laughs> Shelby County, Tennessee has seen a 37% decline in abortions from 2011 to 2014, according to the Tennessee Department of Health. Pro-lifers in the state are contributing this to more education and resources for pregnant women and also legislation that's been passed that regulates the abortion industry. So those are the things that caught our eye today. I'm Missy Stone with Students for Life. If you like the video, give it a share and make sure to follow us on all of our social media channels. If you have any questions, go to studentsforlife.org.